Brandon. Today I'm here to react to episode 3 of season 6, aka the final season of Shit's Creek. And I'm so excited for this episode, guys, because we get to see Ted. I don't think we've seen him at all this season, right? No. So I'm so excited to see how he's been doing in the Galapagos with the Turks. Just chilling, missing Alexis. <laughs> he does look very fit. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> Ted is just like, hey. <laughs> oh, jeez. This is what happens when you live literally next door to your parents and with your brother. <laughs> Ted is just like, hi. <laughs> She's a job interview? Oh, for what? She has a lot of plaid. Like, look at her closet. That is a lot of plaid. That would be cool. I think that was something that was good for her. Because remember, she was saying that she was kind of, like, jealous of Alexis's trip because she got to go out and see the world. Like, I think that's what Stevie needs. I don't know if necessarily being a flight attendant is because you do have to be a bit, um, how do I say this without insulting her? Personable? <laughs> What did, Alexis, did you buy a turtle? She's right, my neighbor had a turtle and I could not stand that thing. It was so gross. She named the turtle Ted. That's kind of weird, right? Okay, but he did have a tortoise and you have a turtle, so... They do look exactly like Patrick's clothes. It's just it's buttoned all the way up. Patrick would have it buttoned a little less. Also, did he actually help her put together an outfit? Because that just looks like something she would normally wear. <gasps> the push. I love him. That was more people than I thought. Does she really want to leave town, though? I thought they were all kind of, like, good there. Because, I mean, obviously if you're invested in the hotel there, you're going to be around there a bit longer, so. What is Bob wearing? Is he, is he wearing leather pants? I really hope they fix Jocelyn's hair before the end of the season. Because it would just suck if this is, like, the last season of the show and her hair is just like that for the whole time. Oh, here he comes. What is he wearing? Yeah. He's a character. I love Jocelyn. She's so, like, optimistic. She lost the turtle, didn't she? Oh my gosh, Alexis. <laughs> She put him in her purse? Oh my gosh. This is why you don't name your turtle after your boyfriend. She should not be a pet owner, really. That turtle's gonna die. <laughs> it's so weird seeing him in like a customer service thing. Oh my gosh, he's making it so much worse. Do you think he also had to tell Patrick, like, he probably didn't even tell Patrick. He just borrowed his clothes and is hoping Patrick will never notice. Which, to be fair, Patrick has a lot of blue shirts, so I think 
he's he might get away with it. Oh, Stevie. <laughs> the smile on his voice is just like your customer service voice. Like, I'm doing it, okay? <laughs> Her wig. I love when we get to see the new wigs. <laughs> Jocelyn's so happy to be a part of this. It's so cute. It's like a little spy mission for her. I don't think this is a good idea. What? <gasps> no! What? No! They're the OTP! The OG OTP! When? Uh, 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 <laughs> I'm so broken hearted. No one's just not getting it. Oh my- Gwen! Let the man live! You broke his heart! I'm crushed right now, guys. Uh-oh. When he gets the hand gestures in, you know we're in trouble. Are we surprised, though? He grew up with Alexis, always wanted to one-up her. Is she gonna do it? Because I also would not trust flying on those planes if I were her. We already all knew that, though, except for David. They are literally, like, ugh, best friends. I love it. Like, siblings. If she does take this job, you know David's just gonna be flying on her things all the time. Just like, hello, being, like, the most annoying customer. Also, I hope she doesn't take this job because it does not seem very safe. Oh my gosh, she still can't find it. That's a fair question with her. She has been abducted many a time. He's not there, is he? Wait, what? She looks so pretty. Oh, that is the cutest thing ever. Oh, I love Ted and I love Twyla for helping with this. <laughs> Look at him, he's just like, oh, fancy seeing you here. <laughs> oh, I love Twyla. Are they really eating though? Because like, is Ted going to eat at the same time? Oh. <laughs> Aww. They're so sweet. I love them. <gasps> oh, we need more Ted, guys. It's the final season. I need more Ted. That's so sweet and cute. Oh. And they were both boop. I love Moira so much. <laughs> You're not pregnant again, are you? What? No. I don't... This better be a good idea because they are in it. You have a baby! Like, with the college expenses that are going to be coming... I mean, 18 years from now, but coming up. Jocelyn's so like. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. I just really hope this all works out for them because a second mortgage. Aww. Ted, you found him. <laughs> what? So many surprising things in that episode, guys. Like, Roland and Jocelyn took out a second mortgage. Yikes. But now they're part of, like, they're really invested in the hotel. Cool. Stevie is exploring other avenues, which is awesome. I don't know if at the end of the day, maybe, like, she'll try something and then come back to the motel. Like, realize that that's her family all along or something like that. But the biggest reveal is that Gwen has left Bob, guys. And is trying to take him for all his money. I am 
broken hearted about this. You don't understand. Like, Gwen and Bob were like the OG OTP. They were the David and Patrick and the Ted and Alexis before. And now, what? not my Gwen. I am just crushed and frankly a little pissed off at Gwen that she would do this to us, especially in season six, the last season. They better get back together, even though I don't know how you could ever forgive her for that because I can't. <sighs> Anyway, if you have seen this episode, please feel free to leave your thoughts about it down below in the comments. Also, make sure this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. A thumb up for uh, poor Bob right now, you know. He needs, he needs a hug. So, thank you guys all so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!